Hi! Welcome to the replay and welcome live viewers. Um, my name is Mariana. I am a biz coach. Um, I help moms work from home um, through finding their passion and making it profitable. So um, as you guys are coming in, um, go ahead to and swipe right and share the broadcast if this is something that you feel that others would benefit from. So today I wanted to talk to you about this whole myth I feel that people um, who are in online business are making like minimum 5k or 10k or whatever number of k's you want to put on there um, and get real with you for a minute. Um, I had a client ask me about this today and I want to be like super transparent and talk about this um, kind of like I guess myth and false reality that's going around so um, first of all you know obviously we don't know everybody's real numbers and so when people are um, giving like these amazing transformation stories like zero to a hundred thousand dollars in like a year and all of this stuff so they could be talking about their income and not be talking about what their expenses are right so like we don't really know what their net profit was and so I I want you guys as you're hearing these crazy ridiculous amazing transformations to kind of keep that in the back of your mind um, as a as a truth like resonating within you because I don't want you to have um, unrealistic expectations and then feel like you're not successful or you're not you know doing an awesome job if you're not making a hundred thousand dollars because you could still be helping so many people you could still be doing some really amazing things and so I don't want anybody to be um feeling like they're less than if they're not getting a certain number of of dollars per month or whatever okay so that's like where I kind of wanted to start and then the other thing is, um, so we don't really know what their expenses are, right? So like they could be spending, like they could have made a hundred thousand and then spent a hundred thousand. Like it's easy to spend a lot of money on between outsourcing and ads. And do you have a copywriter and you have like a Facebook manager and then you have you know like there are a lot of different things that you could be investing your money right back into your business and you know probably in, as you're getting started you're going to be doing that a lot you're going to be investing a lot back into your business because you want it to grow and so that's totally normal and again that's those are numbers that we're not really seeing unless we um are them and we're not so <laughs> okay number two um the other piece I wanted to talk about is it doesn't happen overnight if anyone is telling you that that you can make a hundred thousand dollars in like a short period of time as profit I have to challenge them and say I don't really know if that's true and I'm not trying to be totally negative because I do think let's think big, you know, right? Like let's have huge dreams and huge aspirations. I'm all about that. And I have huge dreams and huge aspirations, huge goals for myself. That doesn't prevent me from making goals. What that does is I want to make realistic goals that I can achieve that are still a stretch for me, right? Like when you're doing your goal setting, you want to have something that's a stretch for you so that you, it is something that you can strive for. But Having something that's realistic, something that you can achieve, and um, and also like a lot of the internet marketers that are really, really good and, and doing very well, like my favorite is Amy Porterfield right now. I freaking love every single thing she does. Everything she does is high quality. Um, I'm taking a course from her and she personally makes videos on questions in her group like she is absolutely amazing she puts a lot of time into everything she does and she does it really really well and you know 
like that level of success and that level of quality first of all comes from quality right so like doing the best work that you can and the other thing is it took her a long time to get there so when you're comparing yourself don't be so hard on yourself how many years of practice do you think that these people have had and um when my client asked me this she's like i think i'm going at it all wrong and i'm thinking well it's not that you're going at it wrong like it takes a level of consistency what if you did those like let's say we pick three activities that we're going to be super consistent on social media and for marketing your business you do them every freaking day for like for example hi coach natasha so like i'm talking about how um there's a misperception about um making a lot of money online and how um a lot of the awesome success stories can be you know, just listen to them. Listen, how many years of practice did it take these people? Um, and if you were to do that same thing, like if you were to come out with a blog post every week, if you were to email your newsletter every single week and write uh, and write to your email subscribers every single day, or I'm sorry, not every single day, you write every single day so you can practice, but like maybe you only send out two newsletters a week. If you were to practice that every day for seven years, don't you think you'd get good? And don't you think people would follow you? So like it takes a, a, a certain level of commitment, dedication, and consistency and persistence. Years, right? Like Shalene Johnson, she's freaking amazing. She's one of my favorite, favorite online biz people. And when you listen to her talk, she she tells you, like she created Pio, I think she said it was like 10 or 15 years ago. 10 or 15 years. And people say she's an overnight success. And she's like, my infomercial is just now on Oh, thank you. Thank you for the hearts. She's like, my infomercial is just now on TV. So I want you guys to superly think about this as you're starting your business, as you're growing, focus on the everyday activities that you can do that are going to grow you as a person that are going to improve the quality of your work and focus like laser beam on that and do that the best you can and you will get better with practice every day but don't expect to make 5k in your first month of coaching um it, and i'm just trying to be real with you right like thank you natasha or thank you thank you coach natasha like i feel like there's a very unrealistic expectation and that's just not reality and so Practice those things every day and you will get better and you will get those followers and you will get people on your list. Um, but only through the consistency, right? Like Periscope and I'm going to be like the first to admit it. I like I come on here and I'll do like six days in a row and then I'll forget and then I go downhill, right? Hi, SK LaBoy. So again, like it's all about the consistency. It's all about keeping going. And um, my message to you is listen, when you hear these huge success and transformation stories, listen to them, listen to their background. Maybe they had a successful business doing something else. Um, you know, maybe they had a different online marketing business that didn't do that well. And then they switched, you know, to a different like niche. You know, like Pat Flynn, he talks about all the different niches that he's um, been able to tap into. Like, listen for real to everything that they say, and you'll see what I'm talking about here. And the one thing that will help them, um, that you see, is that they consistently, consistently keep doing the same thing over and over and over. And their messaging is very much right on. And, um, that's why I love messaging, like working on people with their message. Cause I think it's so crucial. So, um, thanks for the hearts. Um, if you want to share this broadcast with your followers, that would be awesome. Um, again, my name is Mariana, um, Ruiz. I am a biz coach. I help moms, um, work from home more efficiently 
And if you want to um, find me, um, I have a, a little free gift for you guys. It's um, at marianacruiz.com slash time secrets. It's in my bio. Um, just click on that link and you can get the secrets of time management for successful entrepreneurs um, who are moms because this is reality. <laughs> Okay, so have an awesome, awesome day, you guys, and take care.